well, I'm from Texas. Of course I have Western stuff. <laughs>
you know, per se, get a real pair of Western boots. You can always get a Western inspired boot and it will serve you extremely well. And if you get a great quality one, it will last you many, many years. So these are the two pair, a brown pair and a black pair that I'm gonna be using. Now, what I wanna also do is you can take a regular or just a traditional outfit and add a few things to make it brought into with a Western flair. And one of those things is a piece of jewelry. And I happen to have a very, very old piece of handmade silver and turquoise necklace. And this screams Western. And it's very, I don't know how old it is, but I know it's extremely old. And uh, so yeah, so this is something that you can add to an outfit. Uh, turquoise usually is, is, you know, known for having not only Native Americans, but they use it a lot in the Western uh, wear. This is just a belt that I've had for years that I absolutely love. It mimics, it doesn't have a brand. I thrifted it uh, a few years back, but it's, it mimics the conch, conch belts. And now a lot of those are actually on the silver side. This is actually on the gold with brown um, leather straps. Let's, and then a few more things I wanted to show here. Something that really, you know, is just, you know, so Western is fringe, okay? And fringe has been very popular for the last couple of years. So I have some handbags that I've had for years. This is a black suede with a fringe. And then I have a brown one as well too. It's a hobo style with a brown fringe. And then I have one other that this is a handmade, hand tooled Western. It's a saddle bag, but in the square style with a long shoulder strap. So this is, this is so, so cool and interesting. I'd love to know the history on it, but there's no markings on it. I found it at a thrift shop several years ago. So these are three purses that can go with an outfit and bring them into Western flair. So what we've got here now, I picked out three dresses. One, which this is off the shoulder and it is by, who is it by? Um, oh, um, G. And then this one is a dress from Target from the spring. Now most, you'll see a lot of people wearing dresses um, that have the ruffle at the hem. And that's a big wearing with Western wear. Now this one, I bet Target never saw me doing this, but it's just uh, an olive green. I bought it last year in the fall, a knit dress. You'll see how I style that. I've got a denim mini skirt and blue denim. I've got a little bit longer denim, black denim skirt. Those are both from Target as well. I th thrifted last year is a pleated long maxi animal print skirt. Here we have a satin slip skirt animal print from Express that I thrifted. Here is a skirt that is a faux suede, and it's by Reba, Reba McIntyre. She has a line of clothing. And of course, this is very popular in the Western outfits is a full circle skirt. And it's got cutouts. If, I don't know if you can see, you can see it a little bit in the light there. And then you've seen this before, and this is one of my favorite pieces, is the black skirt with fringe. Yes. All right, so I have picked out three camisoles, a black, an animal print, and a white. Now, I picked out some jeans, because of course if we're gonna have boots, we have to have some jeans. Here is a black pair of black uh, skinny, black jeans from Curve Appeal. This one is you would have never thought this, but this is Lauren by Ralph Lauren. I thrifted these about three, four years ago, and 
they were already distressed at the edge. They are a boot cut. And then I have a pair of just basic Ann Taylor denim skinny jeans. I have two leather vests, because that's big in Western wear. I have one from the Limited that I thrifted, and then I have one from a Jeans by Buffalo in a brown that I thrifted as well. Now, it's not a Chris Stapleton t-shirt, but Janet, you might want to get me one. This is a Johnny Cash t-shirt that I used. We're going to zhuzh up an outfit with some black sequins. And that's from Express. Here is another top from Reba. And this is that fall rust color with some kind of, uh, they're gold rhinestones with the silver uh, bezel around it. Now, have to have a denim shirt. And this is from Target. A denim jacket from Lucky Brand. And one of my favorite pieces in, my, in the whole, my, whole world is my Lauren by Lauren um, fringe. And it's lamb's wool, uh, lamb, not lamb's wool, uh, lamb skin leather. This is the softest thing ever that I thrifted about three years ago. A bolero jacket. And you all have seen this before in some of my other videos. It's beautiful colors in it. But the bolero style goes easy with Western as well. I thrifted this, and this is that military type or band type. But still, this kind of uh, mimics in with the, the Western outfits as well. And then this is a longer but not too long coat or blazer. And this is a style that uh, is worn in Western wear as well, too. Uh, it's not from a Western store by any means, but the style of it is mimics in the Western wear that I have seen here. And then, of course, the last pieces, y'all have seen this before, my cabby long coat. And you've seen, I'm sure you've seen in a lot of the Western movies how they wear the long uh, duster coats. So that's where I picked that up from. So that is, that's what we're going to be showing today. And uh, we'll get started on the lookbook right now.
so that concluded the lookbook. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you got some style inspiration for how to take some traditional pieces and zhuzh them up to add a little bit of Western flair. And Janet, I hope that uh, I was able to help you with your question and I hope you've got some good ideas and I can't wait to see what you chose to wear to the concert and I'm so excited for you and I want you to have a wonderful, wonderful time. I want to see a picture of you there in the concert on Instagram or YouTube or something. I want to see it. So, all right. And thank you for asking me uh, to, um, to help you with this. If anybody else has any ideas that they would like for me to put together maybe some outfits for something else, if you have questions, please uh, feel free. I am a personal stylist and I specialize in fashion for the mature woman. And if this is your first time here, let me know what you think. If you like the material here that I gave, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. That would be wonderful. Leave me a comment. Let me know that you stopped by and welcome so I can welcome you and, and introduce myself to you personally. So I'm going to get out of here because I got stuff to do. You got stuff to do. So thank you so much, everybody, for tuning in and watching my video. It means the world to me. And I'm going to tell you what I tell you every single day, ladies, every day, every day, get up and show up because you are worth it. So until I see you in my next video, have a very safe and a very blessed day.